we're going to be soon heading into the jungle to start our trek. We can see a, a family of elephants over there. Malaysia, a fascinating Southeast Asian country with a mixture of modern cities and ancient jungle. Okay, so just disembarked from the boat and I've already found a new friend. That doesn't taste like fruit. It's soon there can be a meal for the elephants. An intriguing place steeped in history and culture. As you can see, the scale is just extraordinary. Because of deforestation, this site is actually becoming rarer and rarer. Watch as we travel the country and piece together a montage of Malaysia. Okay, so we're now going to head back to the orangutan sanctuary to visit the nursery where we'll see some of the younger orangutan. We're here inside the nursery at the orangutan sanctuary. The orangutan here are between 6 and 11 years old and they're playing on this climbing frame to develop the skills they need to navigate the wild jungle canopy where they can live for up to 45 years. We've just returned from the nursery at the orangutan sanctuary where we saw many juveniles. On the way back, we saw various spiders and reptiles, including the snakes that we saw on the night walk that are still in the exact same position. We're now at the Rainforest Discovery Center and we're gonna head over here to the canopy walkway. There are an enormous variety of trees here in this rainforest and from this viewing platform high up in the canopy you can almost touch the tops of some of them. This tree here for example is used to make soap and the seeds from its fruit can be used to make jewellery.
Since the 1960s, there has been extensive deforestation in Borneo, and during the 80s and 90s, the rainforests were leveled at a rate unparalleled in human history, cleared to make way for agricultural land or palm oil plantations. Half of the annual global tropical timber acquisition currently comes from Borneo. Much of the forest clearance that occurs is illegal and has not only impacted the wildlife, but also the indigenous peoples of Malaysia. As you can see, it's beginning to get pretty dark here in the rainforest, and it's beginning to come alive with the sound of the insects and the other nocturnal animals. Better get out while we still can. Another night and another hotel. We've got quite a long drive ahead of us today, back to Tawau, where we're going to catch a flight back to KL and then onward to Langkawi. We really need to be there by about midday, so let's hope the Proton Saga holds up.